Good evening. Welcome to the Beauty Room family. Hello, it is your girl Dawn. Hello, hello everyone and good evening. Today is February 6, 2022 and it is 10.33 p.m. Eastern Standard Time here in Michigan. So yeah, I just got done doing my face. I'll tell you the products at the end that I use my face with and the eye shadow primer that I have on my eyelids. So this is a first look that I promised you um, on a Sunday evening. So happy Sunday. Um, it's going to be a Valentine's Day look. So this is just like a natural type of look if you're going out somewhere in the daytime, you know, to lunch with your bae. Or if you're going to breakfast and then in the evening time, tomorrow it'll be in the daytime, I'll show you a number two look for Valentine's Day. So whichever look you want to rock or if you have your own go for it ladies it is your choice it is your valentine's day but i am i believe i'm off on february 14th which is my grandmother's birthday she'll be 85 years old no i'm sorry 80 she'll be eight yes she'll, yeah, she'll be 85 years old this year yes in 2022 so i just want to say um before i get started thank you so 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 much for watching my video that I did Sunday and to let you know what happened it was what and what, what I was going through and Hamilton was such a supportive soon-to-be husband that he was supporting me and working so much and taking care of me he had a lot on his plate but he was a trooper and I love him so much for that as well and yes and I did a video yesterday on the um, on the haul that I got from Sherry so this is it so we're going to use this palette tonight. It's called the Amore Us. So definitely go to www.amoreus. It's A-M-O-R-U-S or USA.com. And check out their eyeshadow palettes. And this is, I want to say, about a 28 eyeshadow palette right here. And it's under $15. So it's about $12. Um, and then also onto the More Us website, I know it's about $14.50 to $15. Then they also have a 32 eyeshadow palette and an 18 and a 28. So definitely look at their new brand products that they have if you're lighter than me or, you, or if you're in my shade. And if you're darker than me as well. So we're going to get right and start into the video. But this is the eyeshadow palette we're going to use. And also some of my eyeshadow palettes come with mirrors. But this one does because I love the brightness of the palette. And the color story is beyond beautiful. And this is it right here. So yes, we're going to jump right into it. And the ooh, I just dipped my finger in it. So, so it's okay. You know, you got to use your eye palette, you know, your eyeshadow palette. So, I, I try to keep mine extremely neat, but if I can, I can't. So, this is the first shade we're going to go right into, is which I already have my eye primer on already. So, we're going to go right into this shade right here. It's called Peanut Butter. It's right here. So, this is the shade we're going to use for my eyelids and look at that pigmentation that is um, beautiful we're just going to just tap it tap and this is just a transition shade so now we're going to blend it in so we can make sure we're going to get it right over the eye um over the eye crease not under the eye crease just yet because i'm going to use a different color for the eye crease I'm going to use a darker shade, but I just wanted to show you what I'm doing. And then this brush is, of course, by my favorite website. It's AOA Studio. And this is in the E141 brush. This is with the wooden um, eye brushes with this type of um, bristle. And I believe this set could be like between $10 and $10.88. Your change, you go to a donation to whatever charity for children's education. For cruelty free animals um, and another I believe for women so yes definitely check out that website it's www.shopmissa.com and you always tap your brush to get the access of the eyeshadow pigment off and then definitely just go right into it tap pat it on first your first usage 
and then you want to blend it in so tell me about your, your sunday today i hope you had a great sunday today i had an okay sunday and today was my mom's eighth year anniversary since she passed away and i just wasn't um in a well in the greatest mood i was but not really but you know but god got me through it thank the lord jesus and i know my mother is in heaven looking down on her child and her family that we miss us we, uh, we miss her so much and we love her so yeah today wasn't a pretty today wasn't a good day for me but god but like i said god got me through today and hamilton is such a wonderful soon-to-be husband or say father wow no kids just yet but we are working on that situation as well for kids for hamilton and i but we're grateful and blessed to just be working having our jobs and yeah like i said today was just one of those days where i just mm, didn't want to be at work but I had to just you know nonchalant not talk you know much today because you know it's i mean it's been a rough 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 uh, um few years since my mom has passed for me you know and today i about two, three times i promise you all i almost really cried today right there um cashiering you know because you know i'm a cashier sorry there's somebody in my screen sorry um i was cashiering and i i, I just almost bawled my eyes out so i had to excuse myself and ask one of my managers closing managers can i just walk away for a, a moment just one minute and i'll come back she's like yeah that's fine and it's just been a really rough day but god like i said god got me through it and so did hamilton so i'm using the same um bristle brush by aos studio this is the e141 i'm using the same brush but i'm using a different side of it so like the bare side right here right here and i'm using it's called Sang sangera i'm using that for another shade just to get more of a transition shade to it and i'm not patting it on this time and i'm going to use a darker shade as well so yeah i hope you all had a great day today um enjoyed your sunday had a blessful day today just being thankful and grateful for who you have in your life your significant other your children yourself your parents your great grandparents or, or and grandparents you know that are grandparents you know or it took your kids for the weekend you know because you and hubby wanted to have some alone time before valentine's day because you may have to work on valentine's day and now we're going to take a uh, another shade it is called it's called um plum crazy sorry that um i was speaking kind of loud because the heater was on but it, it goes on and also it's like an automatic heater because it's kind of cold in the, in the beauty room so i just wanted to make sure that um i'm not cold in here so um, this is called Plum Crazy. And we're going to just put, apply this like right here. And this is a, I'm using the same brush. So, and look at that pigmentation. OMG. And I'm just patting it on. So that way you can see. Yeah. This is, a, and I put it like right at the crease. Right at the corner right here. So that way you can see the pigmentation. And yes. This is just a beautiful beautiful eye palette so you must gift this eyeshadow palette put it into your cart at cherry.com it's www.cherrie.com definitely make sure you put this palette into your cart because it is beyond beautiful and you can get many looks with this so this will be very pretty for now valentine's day or even after valentine's day if you have to work on valentine's day and i believe it is a monday so yeah so i hope you enjoyed your day today just relax thank god and read your bible or even read a verse today that's what i did when i woke up yeah i just just read my bible and just Thank God that it's, us. it's another day that we all lived, survived, and made it. And I made it through the COVID-19 and pneumonia and a mass in my chest. When I had the COVID and pneumonia, it just 
you know, other people are worse off than me, sick, you know, medical situations, but God is so good. But I continue to pray for those other people that are more sick than I am, but God is so, so, so good. I cannot deny him. I cannot deny him because he got me through it and he can get you through any situation that you are in, you know. So I'm definitely always praying for you all definitely if you like this video so far give it a thumbs up comment like and subscribe tell your family and friends all about the beauty room yeah exactly make sure you hit that notification bell and yes and i just want to say if you're a new subscriber thank you for joining in and thank you for becoming part of the beauty room family thank you thank you so much for supporting me and thank you so so much so my love hugs Thankful this comes from me to you all because you all are the wonderful people in the whole wide world and I thank you for just praying for me, supporting me, and showing me love and just being thoughtfulness to me. And next shade we're going to use, I always try to use like glittery. So I'm going to use a flat brush. I'm going to set that down. I want to use a flat brush. See if I can. Yep. Yeah. And this brush is from sheen it's about a 15 to 12 eyeshadow palette it is under like 12 dollars and this is just a flat flat brush so i'm going to apply it to a color i'm gonna see no i know I'm, I'm not going to use a brush i'm gonna use my fingers because they always say use your fingers more you'll get better product by using your fingers so i'm gonna use my middle finger yeah i'm gonna use my middle finger which is this one right here but i'm not flicking you all off so it's called um, Creamy Plum. So we're going to use that first. Kind of like on the side here. Oh, this is very pretty. And then we're going to apply another shade. It is called Ice Queen. Oh my goodness, wow. Ooh, mixing those two is so pretty. I use Cream Plum and Ice Queen. It is super duper pretty. Oh my goodness, very pretty. So I'm going to use that flat brush or a smaller brush to get the inner corner of right here. So, I'm going to do my other eye right now. I use the same colors that I used before. And I'm using, again, it is called Peanut Butter for my transition shade. And I'm patting it. Now, and I'm going back and forth back and forth hope you all can see the shade that i have but i'm using i'll show i'll tell you all the products that i'm using for the profusion so i'm almost basically done so yeah only thing i gotta do is put um mascara on lip and i'm done so yep yeah. and tap tap And, and I'll tell you what I did to my face, what products I use for my face, and you know, <clears throat> I'll, I'll tell you the products I use for my eyebrows. But yes, this look is a must. This is just the first look for Valentine's Day. And now we're going to go into the shade Sangera. Sangera. Tap off. And put that in a crease. This look is so pretty. This is for like a daytime breakfast type of lunch, brunch, however you call it, you know, with your with your girlfriends or just you and your BFF, you know. This will be very, very, very pretty. So we're going to keep going. And we're going to use, again, 
we're going to go into the other shade it is called lum crazy this shade right here yeah so definitely if you love this look definitely um uh, go to cherry website or to a more us uh, website i'll leave the, the the website in the description box below when i'm done with the video so you all can um go onto the website and it's very reasonable and very affordable it's, uh these this palette is under twenty dollars onto a more us and then it's under it's under twenty dollars as well onto the cherry website as well I want to need a little bit more of that plum um, of that um, plum crazy. Just a little bit more. So you can really see that plum look. Yeah, there we go. I'm going to put a little more over here. Okay, so now we are going to go into that glittery type of not glittery it's kind of like a shimmer it's a shimmer that is called cream plum just gonna apply it right here Oh, that's super pretty. And now we're going to go into, it's called Ice Queen. Oh, color is so pretty. I'm, I should use another finger. I don't want you all to think I'm flicking you all off. And that's not me. That's very rude and disrespectful to the Beauty Room family. So that's not right. Okay. So yes, definitely if you like this look so far, definitely I'm telling you to please put this pretty eyeshadow palette into your cart. I'm looking to see a little bit more. So those are the colors I used. I used Sand Gira, Peanut Butter, Ice Queen, um, Creamy Plum, and Plum Crazy. And yes, a very, very, as you can see, pretty, pretty look. So yes. And now we're done with the eyeshadow palette. And now we're going to put a eyeliner onto my waterline. Wow, look how black this eyeliner is. That is awesome. Wow, that is really, really good. And you can definitely um, not have the black eyeliner. You can do like a pink if you're a lighter skin tone than me. Because if I do like a, um, like a lighter eyeliner for my skin tone, it won't look right. So I got to go with will look right on me but definitely give this look a try okay so that is that uh this is a very good eyeliner this is from from amore us i got the whole entire set i have the black i have i'll i'll just tell you the whole set when i do a video on the on the gel eyeliner but i just want to just show you how this looks see it comes it's down like that and then it comes up. That's all. It, it gets higher, but I try not to make it too high. And then this is how the black looks. That's the gel black eyeliner. It's, oh, it's very good. So I definitely have no problems with that. And now since we're done with that, I need to put a inner corner into my eye. I don't know which one to use. So I will go for... Hmm, something bold. Let's see. And oh, I want to use that brush. Oh, yeah, here it is. 
And this is a, a different brush. This is from the whole collection of Sheen. And this brush is about between a 12 to 15 eye um, brush set. This has like the tan and then the tie-dye mint green, like a brownish. Very, very pretty. And I'm going to go for, it's called Fruit Punch for the inner corner. Let's just see how it looks onto the inner corner of my eye. Oh, wow. Okay, that's very, very pretty. And it's called Fruit Punch. So, I'm not, you don't have to use too much for the inner corner. Just very, very little. So, yep, yeah, that is it for that. It's right here. It's called Fruit Punch, which is right there. Hope the mirror didn't blind you. And yeah, I'm gonna put this back because I don't need that brush anymore. And yeah, I'm just gonna just do the lips, and we're basically done with this look. And I'm gonna make sure my hair is down to the ponytail because I had it like this all day today at work. So I do have a mirror like right here, but I'm looking right at here so you can see it. And I cleaned my face with my products that I love to use. Wow, this is a oh my goodness. You all have to get these. These are from uh from Cherry. It's called Amuse Cosmetics. And this is called Tease. This is a pretty lip gloss. As you can tell you can put like a little more lip gloss onto this if you want. Let me see what I have in here. Yes, I do. I have the Beauty Supply um Broadway Ulta Lip Mango Butter Lip Gloss just for a few dollars maybe it may be a little more since it's you know prices are going up so in groceries but i don't know if it's going on beauty products but yeah it's a very very vague a little bit oh uh, my goodness wow i didn't know that this lipstick looked that good i mean because how you have light colors onto you know your face and you're a darker skin tone woman and some color looks good on you and some don't but that's your own opinion to your own face but definitely definitely go to your beauty supply store that you shop at for any of your needs for anything and then this is the nico k new york mega value mascara it's waterproof intense for fuller lashes yes this is a very 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 good um mascara and it's in black as you can see well i poked my summer eyeball again as usual <laughs> excuse me yes oh yeah and this does give you volume if you're also if you're putting on um lashes as well just put a, a couple of coats of mascara onto your eyelids i usually do wear eyelashes but i'm trying to learn more how to apply them because you know i'm just like not a lash type of girl but i do have a bunch of lashes into my basket over there that i do need to practice on and practice with because you know i just don't want to um not try you know i don't want to let myself down or fail when trying to apply lashes but i have been watching a lot of youtube videos of how um ladies put eyelashes on and i'm still practicing so but i'm just doing the bottom and i am about done with this look yes wow this look could be basically kind of pretty if you look into the mirror onto this look this would be pretty if you're going somewhere like at night too or in a like in the daytime so i just want to just put my hair like this so you can really really see how it looks 
you know, if your hair on braids or whichever hairstyle you have, definitely, definitely try this look. I'm not going to put any setting spray on because I'm going to basically take this whole entire makeup off. But yeah, I just wanted to let you all know about the products. So we're going to start off with the mascara first. So this is what I use. This is by Nico K. And this is the Mega Value Mascara Waterproof Intense for Full Glow Lashes. It's in a definitely black or very black. But I believe this is in EMM V0101 black. Definitely, definitely get that. And definitely just let me know how you like this look. Oh my goodness. What do you think? <laughs> oh my goodness. So yes, the products that I used for my face was the L'Oreal Paris Inflammable um, Full Wear. This is the concealer. Yes, yeah, the concealer. And this is um, in, let's see. It's an Espresso 445. Yes, 445 in Espresso. I just put it like right here on my nose to do a contour. And I did a contour on my forehead and right here onto my right cheek and to my left cheek. And then, you know, my eyebrows pencil that I use is my fave. It's the Stima Brown, S-I-M-M-A Brown by what and wow for 99 cents you can find it at your local family dollar dollar family dollar dollar general if they have and uh what other store and also try um five below i think of it and also you may want to try the dollar well i can't say it, a dollar tree but now it's a dollar 25 for items from the dollar tree so definitely check out your like I said, your family dollar, Dollar General, Dollar Tree, and check out Five Below for the Wet n Wild SEMA Brown Eyebrow Pencil. It'll, it'll say for your eyes and lips, but I just use it for my brows. And also, definitely get this lip gloss by Glaze Lip. It's a kind of like a semi lip gloss, but it goes on very smooth. I love the color of it. It's a new color to go with this look. And a definitely, this is just like going to say between a dollar twenty-five and a dollar fifty or two dollars. So I just ordered me some more of these lip glosses because I'm already in love and I already used it like one time. So yes. So like I need more lip glosses and lipsticks, but I wanted to have this into my lip my lip gloss collection. So and yes, um, definitely get these, um, this gel eyeliner. It is from Amor Us. It's A-M-O-R-U-S or U-S-A dot com for their gel um, eyeliner. And definitely, yes, it goes very, very well, as you can tell. Very, very good. I love it. Yes. And definitely um, the eye primer that I use. For my eyelids, it is definitely my top fave number one from Profusion Cosmetics. It's www.profusioncosmetics.com. It is called the Profusion Eyeshadow Primer. It's no budge, no fuss. And this is the weight, net weight, a 0.34 fluid ounce and a 10 milliliter. Yes, definitely get this. This is, uh, this is under $10, so it's about 4 to five to six dollars definitely check out that website of profusion cosmetics and if they do not have it or if they're sold out definitely um go to your local walmart and definitely get a couple of these if you're a makeup artist or if you're a makeup pro or if you just got a cosmetics cosmetic school excuse me or beauty school i'm sorry rather beauty school definitely for your clients for your new clients or even to, pra to practice on yourself be very very good to have for five dollars cannot beat that so yes and also for the concealer i'm making heat mess right here but okay that i use for underneath my eyes so when i applied my foundation after i cleaned my face and everything like that this is by maybelline this is the super stay full coverage under eye concealer you know how my eyes are without concealer and how they're deep, they're pu not puffy, but they're really deep, dark circles that I have. And this covered it very, very well. So I highly 
recommend this. This is in a, um, a net weight of a 0.23 fluid ounce, 7 milliliter. And then the shade that I'm in for me, for my skin tone, it's called Tan 45. So definitely if you have your pen and pencil right next to you with a notebook or notepad, write down the items that I'm showing you to get. Definitely make sure you get them at your local Walmart, five below, go into the websites that I just told that I just told you about. And definitely for the setting, well, the makeup setting spray that I use, it is called Amore Us Makeup Fix, a natural finish setting spray. And this is in a six, 60 milliliter dash 2.3 ounce. So this is super cute. It's like a white top very hot pink or pink with the white and gold writing it's very cute and girly onto your vanity or into your table whatever and then the foundation that i used oh the foundation that i use is the revlon this is the canid photo well, photo ready canid and the shade that i'm in for me is in the 5.50 and it's in a 0 0.75 fluid ounce dash 22 milliliter and it has no spf anything but i do like that this is just for the winter time and this also lasts um, for about 24 months and again the shade that the revlon foundation that i'm in it is the 550 mocha m-o-c-h-a and it also has a pump i do like that and then this is the shade right here that's the shade and it's very very a good shade it matches my skin tone very very well as you can tell love it yes and also definitely make sure you get this eye shadow palette <laughs> upside down excuse me definitely make sure you get this eyeshadow palette it's called bubble pop and it's from a more us ww a-M-O-R-U-S or USA.com. Very, very girly, pretty. I love the color story. I love the box and the container. I love pink. Anything pink, I love, as you can tell. This will be very, very, very pretty for Valentine's Day, for a daytime, or even a night look because I'm looking in the mirror now and this looks super, super pretty. Even with that glitter that I put on to my inner corner of my eyelids it's called fruit punch and this is under twenty dollars so it's about between fourteen fifty and like fifteen dollars so I, I put in some other things onto my cart but i won't get them until this week but it'll be within the week or two after um, valentine's day so i will do a haul on that when that future bag comes i will do that and also the brushes that i use this is a set from Sheen under $12. It's about between the 12 to 15 set eye brush. And it is that price between 20, not 20, about 12 to $15 or less. And it comes with this type of material, the rose gold, the tannish brownish type of color, and then the, the tie dye mint green. I'm really still liking mint green as my color still this year, but I still love my pink. Don't get me wrong, I still love my pink. Yes, yes, yes. I love my pink. And then, of course, this is the Shop Miss A AOA Studio Brush for your eyes. It's an E141 brush. Loved it. It blends very, very well, as you can tell. Love that. Love, love. I love everything that I love. I'm not going to be saying that. I love. But which I do. I love everything that I have and own. I definitely love the products that I use tonight. So this is the first look for valentine's day makeup look i hope you like this video give it a thumbs up comment like and subscribe please tell your family and friends and i just want to say please stay safe and encouraged i just want to say thank you for stopping by um having your few moments with me with your makeup brushes if not your coffee and tea soda whichever thing you drink you can also have this look too for game day for the you know for your boot you know not for his friends, but just, you know, to make yourself look cute, you know, watching a game too. Because us women, we know we know some football stuff too, you know, okay? I know a little about you know, a little bit about football, but not as much. I know when, I know when the the guys, you know, when the football players get touched up, I'm like, Yeah, 
Okay, good job. So I always wear like a neutral type of um like hoodie with the matching um, pants because I don't know which team to go for. But last week, um, I think it was the Stan Stanford and oh, I forgot the other team. So I had so many guy customers that come in and we talked for just a minute or two about football and then I asked them, you know, what team plays, you know, and stuff like that. So yeah, I love, love, love it. So definitely give, give this look a try. This is the first Valentine's Day look of number one i have two more to do and yes i hope you enjoyed this video god bless you all please stay safe and encouraged and i will see you in the next video god bless have a great sunday bye thanks for watching